Hello everybody and welcome to Bell CB. Uh, what we're going to do today is we're going to change this Conic Saturn. You see when they when they modify for full channels, here's A1, 25, 6, 15, and then B, C, D, E, F, 40, 28, 305. Well that's just the start of the phone band. Um, doesn't leave us much room to do anything with that. So we're going to change it so that A1 is CB1, this one right here. See that? That's going to move all the way to A1. One, two, three more bands are going to be on this end now. So that'll be CB, and all the way up to here, we'll go all the way through 10 meter band, 29.7. What we're going to do is replace X2 this crystal right here with a 15.36 <coughs> so on the bottom I'm going to have to take this shield off and on the top remove that little bit of solder and of course the two solders underneath when the shield comes off so let me pop that out of there and we're going to put it in the other crystal. I'm going to show you. Okay, so I just want to emphasize when you take this shield off, you come over here and you heat this one up. And lift him up. And then this one. I want to emphasize to be really careful not to get solder on anything. No bridges into other areas. Be really careful with that. Okay, so these are the tuning coils. So there's our crystal right here. This point and this point here. So we'll just go ahead and remove that solder. And that. our crystal. You're going to need to scrape the top of this crystal so that you can put that solder blob between the can and the crystal again. And then you're going to need to let it cool completely down. Heat the radio. <laughs> I know it sounds funny let it cool completely down, but right there it's terribly hot. We want it to just cool back down to room temperature, turn the radio on, let it sit uh, and warm up for about 20 minutes, uh, regular radio temperature, and then we could do the alignment on the frequencies. Let's see what we got over here now. We got a new crystal in there. So now we're all the way down to one. See, there's some frequency alignment to do here. And there's channel 40 on the high band, 49.6. So you're going to need to realign the AM, upper sideband, and lower sideband to be back on frequency. Um, just open up, uh, open up the manual and do the realignment to the synthesizer, transmitter, and receiver with a special attention now to the balancing between A1 it's, uh, and F40. So uh, balancing between channel C, CB channel 1 and all the way to the top end of the 10 meter band, you got to get a, a balance there like in the receiver this receiver chain here the balance is done primarily right here with these two and then the transmitter here and over here uh, you're going to want to balance those out and that's it this should get you rock and rolling uh, I did a real rough one here just so you can see so now we got 26.965 go up to the top end 29.655 and all the bands in between so yes there's going to be no more below CB with this modification if you want all of 10 meter and all of 11 meter you're not going to go down below CB into that free band it's not going to work out for you 
there's not enough bands on this radio.